What else to talk about tonight? Well, this is interesting. We're midway through the summer television season. I can't believe the summer is halfway over. And so the summer uh, television season is halfway done. And, of course, summer is when American TV is flooded with reality shows. You know what I'm talking about. You turn on a TV right any time during the summer, and all you're going to see is reality television. Well, of course, reality television is now the craze all over the world, and almost every country has its own hit reality show. So tonight, I thought it'd be fun to check out some of these international programs in a little segment we like to call Foreign Reality TV Shows. <laughs> Now, the, uh, the first show is the highest-rated game show in Armenia, all right? It's called Miak Biak, which means man stash, lady stash. I didn't know what that meant either until I, I looked at the show. Enjoy. <laughs> The next up is a show I, uh, I got a lot of people back in Ireland, and I go back occasionally, and I saw this one in Ireland. It's called It's My Round, Mate. It's a reality show from Ireland in which two Irishmen in a pub compete to see which will get to buy the other one a drink. It's pretty exciting. Take a look. Mulligan, my friend, let me buy you this pint. No, Ryan, this round's on me. Oh, I insist this round is on me, sir. No, let me buy you a drink. Put your money away, you bastard. This round is mine. I said let me buy you a drink. You bastard. <laughs> let me buy you a pint. I want to buy you a drink, you stinking bastard! But I've got the next one. Like hell you do! <laughs> oh, a point for my dead friend. That's action pack, that show. That's how it is over there. All right, this, uh, this next show is a very popular show, After Hours, uh, in uh, Sweden. That's right, it's called Flika Borta Jur av Bergman, which translates to Bergman's Girls Gone Wild. <laughs> Take a look. Visa me dina bras. Jag kan visa de blatt ansam och förtvivlan. Jag dat för visa as dina bras. This next show is from the Vatican. It's a game show called Heaven, Hell, or Purgatory that tries to guess where famous people will go after they die. Welcome back to Heaven, Hell, or Purgatory. Our next celebrity is Diane Keaton. Ah, uh, yes. Leading American actress of the 1970s, no one played lovable befuddlement better, but she did have sexual relations with both Woody Allen and Warren Beatty, without the benefit of marriage, she's going to hell. Oh, come on. She's no Meredith Baxter Bernie, but she's no Ellie McGraw either. I say purgatory. You say hell, you say purgatory. Our savior said... Purgatory. She's not going to hell. What a chipper thing. Uh, and finally, this last foreign TV show is a hit prank show. Those are prank, you know, those prank shows are big. It's a hit prank show from Colombia. It's called Cocaine Cut-Ups. It follows ordinary Colombians as they try to fool local drug lords by selling them cocaine they've cut with everyday household items. Check it out. Hoy, vamos a cortar esta pura cocaína con azúcar de la cocina. Vamos a ver si la gente que venden drogas notan la diferencia. 
Ahí están. Van a tener una gran sorpresa. Hola, muchachos. Te tengo un regalito. Well, there's our happy comedy for the night. We'll take a little break. When we come back, Tim Robbins is here. Stick around.